School health centers at the Center for Family Health are back open and open to serve you. So if uh, you just need to see someone, you're not feeling well, they can help. The school health centers at the Center for Family Health, all are welcome. Northwest Community High School, Jackson High School, Northeast, and of course, Parkside. The Center for Family Health has been opening the door to healthcare for all in Jackson for more than 30 years. And a good way to stay healthy is to keep it clean. And we have got Leonard Phillips here from Keeping It Clean right here in Jackson. Hi, thank you for having me on. Yeah, good Appreciate morning. It. Thanks yeah. for being here. Yeah. What's going on? Well, um, business, right? Business yeah. as usual, uh, still helping uh, folks out, um, helping out with the community, uh, giving back with a lot of our cleanings and stuff like that. Um, taking care of our cancer patients. I joined a couple of boards this, uh, okay. this past year. Um, nice. So I'm on the Mission Hope Cancer Foundation nice. and City of Jackson Oversight Policing Commission. So it's some new positions for me. So you and uh, your wife, Dawn. Correct. Yeah, you are the uh, owners of Keeping It Clean. And yes. congratulations on being named this year's Thank Small you. Business Person Thank of you. the Year. That's quite an honor. That was very much an honor. I was just explaining to her how nice it was to yeah. see the venue going out from there to Veritas was I think very special. Yeah. yeah, and I don't know if they do that because that was my first time. And I, you could, you were at the U of M game yeah. that night. Yeah. But on like every, I don't know, twenty feet, they had people dressed up um, with signs that said, you know, congratulations so cool. yeah. to Don yeah. Phillips yeah. of yeah. keeping it clean as yeah. Small yeah. Business Person of the Year. And then the next one would have the next award. That's cool. And I was so inspired that whole night by everything that our community has to Absolutely. offer. But your story, your family's story, really hit home and something that has stuck with me ever since. Um, on top of being a great cleaning service, you have a mission that I think our viewers would love to hear about. So our mission really is, um, we have a lot of great uh, people in our company and the, the main focus is focusing on our people because we know if we don't focus on them, mm -hmm. then our clients won't get that care yeah. that they need. Uh, which has really been important. The other uh, main focus is taking care of our community, mm -hmm. and that's part why we joined Cleaning for a Reason, uh, which helps us to go out and clean for cancer patients for free. That's awesome. That's incredible. Uh, and that was due to our son. Um, it started from, it's kind of stemmed from that when he had cancer at 19. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Amazing story. And Dawn had shared, you know, she's like, I didn't, didn't know what was up and down, let alone when I was going to have time to, you know, clean the toilet or pick up the kitchen. And, and she took that stress and anxiety and turned it into something really great where you guys find this niche and this need in the community and mm -hmm. fill it. If somebody in our community is in need um, of need yes. of your services, Absolutely. Um, because they or somebody in their family are fighting cancer, how do they get in touch with you? Yeah, they can just call us, uh, 990-5772. Okay. Um, or they can reach uh, us through email at contact at kic.services. Okay. Very unconventional last part. A lot of people say, is it .com? No, it's dot .services. We pay for that. Okay. Uh, try to make it easier for everybody. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's and it's really that simple. We also have on our website, um, there's a part in there. Um, I believe it's on our website. If it's not, it's in one of my uh, uh, blog pieces that okay. I'm putting out. So people can just literally click cool. on it, fill out the application, they don't have to okay. contact anybody, and okay. then the, they'll contact us and say, hey, here's your new patient, mm -hmm. go okay. take care of them. And uh, I'm very familiar with the uh, commercial cleaning because you guys do yeah. JTV, and it's been amazing. This is Great. always spotless. We're really excited. Amazing. The bathroom's always spotless. And I, I need to apologize whoever handles my office, but <laughs> whoever was in my office, they found something I was looking for the other day. Serious? <laughs> on my desk. <gasps> but everything is awesome, and you guys, that's almost like you're net never satisfied but you want to make sure that your clients are 100 percent absolutely satisfied. above and beyond yeah i'm actually creating a new uh thing uh for our in-house people it's going to be a 360 view cool. of what's going on did you do this did you do this did you do nice. this and okay. then if they don't check them that means it's not complete yeah, yeah. yeah that's amazing it's really important to make sure that stuff is done so busy parents you know we're all running around with yes. our, our heads cut off and sometimes that housework is what gets put by the wayside. So if somebody just needs your help once or twice a month, is that something you guys are open Absolutely. to? Absolutely. We do weekly, bi-weekly, and monthly services, okay. uh, one-time services. A lot of times um, we get some from uh, realtors that will call us up and say, hey, I've got a person selling their house. We need to get it cleaned up yep. on, so we can get it on the market. Mm -hmm. uh, move in and move outs. Yeah. What about, the guys are asking me upstairs, windows? So yes. So okay. we do a small part of windows. Okay. What I mean by that is, I have another company that I refer any of the larger jobs okay. out to. Okay. Um, 
Uh, but it, usually what it is entails is us, we'll get anything we can hand reach. Okay. Um, okay. A lot of times it has to deal with and insurance. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if the window will flip in, we're, we're happy to take oh, care of that. What's the most overlooked part of, of house cleaning? Dusting. Dusting. Yeah. Yeah. Dusting, <laughs> Dusting seems like, yeah. Like everybody, you get your fans. So we get make sure we get all the high and lows. We have a clean that's called the top to bottom. Okay. And so we want to make sure that, you know, everybody does that. We do hand washing of baseboards, spot checking walls, um, which should be in part of that um, weekly routine. Yeah. You ever um, measure the dust? By in centimeters on the top. Of I'm this. not going to tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've but been we've been in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. When you get can. into some of the homes, you will see that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and I specifically would, if if I had to, uh, which I'm thinking I haven't had to, but uh, I will take a ladder out and go on top yeah. of it. If it's something yeah. that's so caked on that yeah, you can't yeah. get off with the brushes. Yes, you, gotta, you gotta get it off. So this time of the year, I think we all just kind of get a little restless and want uh -huh. something new and fresh and we dive into that spring cleaning yeah. for about an hour. And then Listen, you get distracted by something else. You're not else. gonna do a good enough job. You're not, <laughs> you are not. I tell this to my clients all the time, hire a professional. So yeah. will you come in and just do that seasonal deep clean? Absolutely, and right now, uh, for any of the viewers that are watching this show, uh, we're gonna do a 50% off <gasps> of that oh, spring nice. clean for them. Awesome. Okay. Um, and also, you hear that? to give our uh, current clients, we're gonna give them a 50% off Awesome. Because a lot of times is exactly what you said. You don't have time to do everything. Yeah. yeah. Um, and we want to make sure that you have a healthy home to, to live. A lot of people live with allergens. Yes. And so it's so important to get in there and get that dust out. Yeah. Like I said, that's the biggest thing that gets hit, you know, missed, I should say. Yeah. How'd you guys get into the business? <laughs> <laughs> My wife, we were both in medical and okay. um, somebody asked her, hey, um, I'm doing some work in my house and this gentleman that she was talking to said, well, you can come do mine. She said, I won't, but I know somebody that will. And she uh, cleaned for this gentleman. And after that, it just kind of referraled. Yeah. Ah. And then she pulled me out of my work yeah. a little by little and then fully kind of retired me out of that. What and a said, great story. You're working here with me now. And that's wow. cool. So since 04, uh, but in 05 is when we actually came a real business. Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's awesome. That's and uh, yeah. many more honors to come. You guys, yes. great local business. Appreciate everything we you do. We appreciate that. Congratulations again Thank on you. Uh, being named small business person of Absolutely. the year. Yes. And uh, sorry, Dawn couldn't make it today, but yeah, we'll sorry. Yes, see you in her no, next no. time. <laughs> She's See such an inspiration. Yeah. 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 She's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Leonard Phillips from Keeping It Clean. More of the morning show right after this quick break.